Hello everyone. So in this video, I will demonstrate the three basic logic gates which are NOT, AND, and OR gate on breadboard. So let's start with the NOT gate. So this is the truth table for the NOT gate. This logic gate simply negates one input. As we can see, if the input is an OFF state, the output will be an ON state. If the input is an ON state, the output will be an OFF state. So let's proceed to the actual demonstration on breadboard. So this is our IC for the NAT gate and as we can see, it only needs one input which is indicated as one in our switch. So this LED bulb serves as the output. So if we will turn the switch on, the IC will receive an on state signal. However, the output is in off state. On the other hand, if we will turn the switch off, the IC will receive an off state signal but the output is in on state. So this is the true table for the AND gate. So in this table, A and B are the inputs and C is the output. So if you analyze it, it will only have an on state output if both of the inputs are in on state. So as we can see, if both inputs are off state, the output will be off state. If there is only one on state, the output will still be off state. However, if both inputs are in on state, the output will be an on state. So this is our IC for our AND gate and it requires two inputs which are indicated as two and three in our switch. This LED serves as the output for the IC. So if both of the inputs are turned on, the LED will light up. If we will turn off one of the switches, the LED will turn off. If we turn off both of the switches, the LED will still turn off. So this is our true table for the OR gate. So in this table, A and B are the inputs and C is the output. So as you can see, it will only have an OFF state output if all of the inputs are in OFF state. However, if there is at least one in on state input, the output will always be an on state. So this is our IC for the OR gate and it requires two inputs from the switch which are indicated as 4 and 5. This LED serves as the output. So if we turn on both of the switches, the LED will light up. If we turn off one of the switches, the LED will still light up. However, if we turn off both of the switches, the, the LED will turn off.